So are you thinking of moving to Hartwell, Georgia? Well, in this video, we are going to show you around Hartwell and we're going to take you through some neighborhoods, show you some different places. Uh, just kidding, just kidding. I'm thinking about my neck, I'm sorry, my chin, whatever. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Show you some, some different price points and some different homes so that you can see what may fit with your budget. And if you stick around until the end, I will show you the best kept secret of what this city definitely has to offer and so you don't want to miss. So let's get busy. your first time to this channel and you want to know everything about living in Hartwell, Georgia and the surrounding cities, then subscribe below and tap the bell for notifications so that you can be the first to know about the current market in Hartwell and the surrounding cities. My name is Melissa B. McCall, also known as The Selling Bee, and my team and I get calls and emails every day from people just like you looking for help on making their move to the Northeast Georgia and the Western Upstate South Carolina, and we absolutely love it. So whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, give us a call, shoot us a text, or send us an email. All of that information is in the description below so that we can help you make a smooth move to the Northeast Georgia area. So as I mentioned before, we are in Hartwell, Georgia, and I love this place because this is where I was born and raised. Yes, I went to school here, church here, I played here, graduated from here, I left here and came back here to then start a family here. I taught here and now I sell real estate here. And as many of us do when we are younger, you know, we can't wait to leave and go to a place as soon as we turn 18. Well, I left and I felt blessed to come back and raise my family here and work in the community here. As you can see, I am in the lovely downtown Hartwell area. And over the last few years, the community has really pushed to restore the beauty of the older buildings and bring in wonderful options of restaurants, shops, and services for people to enjoy, especially during the warmer months. Hartwell Downtown is home to a live theater production company, fine arts center, art galleries, and a live music venue. Every Saturday night, you can find something. You also catch a play. You can listen to music, take an art class, go shopping or antique hunting in downtown Hartwell. And when you come visit, you definitely want to be outside and walk the town. Enjoy the historic walking tour that's also available for you. And then you can also see the behind the scenes stories of many of the town's historic landmarks. We are also home to two golf courses, five campgrounds with 274 campsites for any RV or tent set up right on the lakeshore. And then there are nine picnic recreation areas. You get multiple boat ramps and two hunting reserves. Hartwell is home to Lake Hartwell and it's located in the Northeast Georgia area on the Georgia South Carolina border, which is about an hour and a half north of Atlanta and an hour south of Greenville, South Carolina right off of I-85. Hartwell's population is 4,200 hardworking, good-hearted folk. Lake Hartwell, it contains about 55,900 acres of shoreline. The number of visitors to Lake Hartwell has increased regularly from about 750,000 in 1962 to 9.6 million in 2000. This ranked Hartwell third of the 10 most popular core projects in the nation. Now we have seasonal festivals in Hartwell, Georgia, including the Antique Boat Festival, the annual Lake Hartwell Dam Run, the Pre-Fourth Extravaganza, Depot Days, the Spring Fever Regatta, and many more. It's located on the historic Depot Street and the Hart County Community Theater also offers performances throughout the year there. The Art Center is located on the square and it has monthly view viewings of local art. You can also visit High Cotton, while in Hartwell just to hear house bands play with nationally known performers and you can check them out on Facebook for performance day. One of Hartwell's pride and joy locations is a glorious place called Petit. 
Katichi. Katichi is home to gorgeous rolling hills that creates this magical experience for any type of special events, private lodging, fine dining, and state-of-the-art golfing. I have been privileged to attend weddings, fundraisers, holiday parties, and class reunions at this location. And for many people, it's a weekly place to end their busy work weeks to unwind. This is definitely a place you don't want to pass up. Lake Hartwell has over 960 miles of shoreline and approximately 56,000 acres of water. On a lake of this size, everyone can enjoy boating, skiing, jet skiing, canoeing, and sailing. If fishing is your sport, the 21 fish species that are in Lake Hartwell will keep your pole jumping, I'm sure. Campers find relaxation and enjoyment um, definitely in these well-maintained campgrounds in the areas. There are three state campgrounds. Now, if fishing is your sport, the 21 fish species in Lake Hartwell will keep your pole jumping. Campers find the relaxation and enjoyment of being in well-maintained campgrounds in the areas. Uh, five state campgrounds there are. There are four Army Corps of Engineer campgrounds. Um, you can spend a Saturday night at Clem Shoal Creek Music Park with some breathtaking views and you can hear some bluegrass, some country, and gospel music playing as well. Now definitely plan to spend a weekend touring homes, shopping, dining at some of the restaurants and the eateries. And when you head over to Franklin County, be sure to stop by the center of the world located on Highway 29 South. This is a sacred Cherokee Indian assembly ground that the Cherokees consider to be the center of the world. As I mentioned before, golfing is in Lake Hartwell area. It's definitely here at its best. For golfing, you can see what Katiji has to offer. They have 475 acres designed by renowned architect Mike Young, and it was built in 98. Katiji also wanders through about 474 acres of spectacular landscape. You also have wonderful opportunities at the Hartwell Golf Course as well. Golfing in Lake Hartwell area is here at its best. Now there are about 4,500 people that make up the Hartwell population, but then there are small towns that surround Hartwell that make up Hart County that cause the population of Hart County to be 26,000. And other cities that make up the county of Hart are Bowersville, some parts of Cannon, Royston, and some parts of Livonia. Now before I share with you information about the jobs and the schools, I would love to take you around and show you some of the neighborhoods and what your money could get you in housing. So let's go. So if you're moving from any of the major cities around the US where the cost of living is considered expensive, then I would suggest that you definitely consider Hartwell because your money can go a long way here, especially if you're working remotely from home and you're able to maintain the same level of income. Now here, I am currently nestled in a cute, family-friendly neighborhood about a mile from the lake and only about five minutes to town, shopping and restaurants. Now, this subdivision is known as Stillwood and Peak Estates, and it's a highly sought after community for first-time home buyers because there are great neighbors here and it's outside of the city limits, yet it's still really close to town. And it's super close to the lake. Homes in this neighborhood range from about 1,400 to 2,000 square feet. And in price point, they range from about 250 to 300,000 uh, currently. This subdivision does not have any HOAs or special amenities. And these two subdivisions are, are they're not huge at all. They're small little neighborhoods that are just big enough for you to know your neighbors. As a matter of fact, there are several neighborhoods like this all throughout Hartwell. Now let's move on and see what you could get for three hundred to four hundred thousand dollars. So there are several pockets of old and newer neighborhoods with homes in the three to four hundred thousand dollar price range, and most of these neighborhoods also do not have HOAs. However, there may be some covenants and restrictions in these neighborhoods. So. What you will find is that in this price point, if you find a home that is over 2,000 square feet, then you're probably not going to get as much acreage. Some of you that are relocating may not be accustomed to having any yard, so probably about a third to half an acre to you may seem heavenly, whereas a lot of the locals here are usually looking to find property that's two to five acres, especially when they're looking for their second home or to upgrade. 
Now the homes in this neighborhood of Brookhaven are new construction homes. They are ranging from about three to four hundred thousand dollars. They have about 2,000 square feet plus, and many have at least four bedrooms, three baths, or two and a half bath floor plans. And they're sitting on about half of an acre, maybe a little bit more to an acre. Now, what can you get for five to $700,000? Now, if you're feeling like you wanna get in touch with nature by way of farm life, or have enough room to raise some chickens and goats and a few horses or some cows, then you're definitely gonna be looking for property that's between five to 20 acres at least. And the way the market goes here is that you are either going to pay for more square footage and less acreage or more land, more acreage and less square footage. But you definitely have options. Also, what's so great is the opportunity to live on the beautiful Lake Hartwell in this price range. You would be able to purchase a lake house, possibly fully furnished, with a private dock and some gorgeous lake views. People come to this lake to visit and then they decide they wanna stay because it feels like home and they believe that the community is special and the community really is special. So the average sales price of homes in Hart County since the beginning of 2022 is about 376,000. And if you have a budget of a million dollars plus, then you have options between farms, resort style lake homes, and a, or a custom built house. It's totally up to you. There's about a 74% property ownership rate for Hart County with a growing demand for rental properties. Now you might be asking, Melissa, why is there growing demand for rentals? Well, it leads me to my next topic, which is the job opportunities here. And the reason why there's such a demand for rentals and more housing is because of the job industries like Nestle Carina, Herring, Lake Foods, Linda Veeman, and many more companies have brought job opportunities here. And people are coming from all over to seize what's available. Not only do you have industrial manufacturing, many different things going on here, but you have the poultry farm business. It's one of the top industries here, along with other side staple industries like the healthcare field, public education, and small businesses. Uh, there's room for many small businesses here. Also, Hartwell is only 15 minutes from the main interstate, I-85, which leads to Atlanta one way for an hour and Greenville for another hour in the opposite direction. Up and down the Interstate 85 are more job opportunities in other smaller communities as well. So it's a perfect location for raising a family in a calm, relaxed environment, yet having access to all of the major shopping, food, entertainment, and job industries only about an hour away. By the way, you guys stayed until the end, so I wanna share one of the best, not widely known secrets about Hartwell. And I believe that what sets Hart County apart in its very unique, lovely spirit is that it is the only county that is named after a woman. This, the, the city and the county and the lake were all named after the Revolutionary War heroine, Nancy Hart, whose opposition to the British rule is legendary. So you definitely wanna check out this story if you aren't familiar. Now many people move to the area for jobs, but mainly for the retirement atmosphere that the lake provides. Hart County has a strong charter school system and the Hart County charter school system consists of schools in the district like Hartwell Elementary, North Hart, South Hart Elementary, um, you have the Hart County Middle School and the Hart County High School. And I actually worked in the school system for 11 years and I enjoyed working with my colleagues and the students while I was there. There is also a private school called Barnes Academy, and there are several homeschooling communities here as well. Now, I wanna take you inside my favorite coffee shop here. It's located downtown. We're inside Common Ground, and the owners are phenomenal. Of course, y'all know I love to order me some yummy chai tea with almond milk, but really guys, you they have the best I've ever tasted. It's also the sweetest I've ever tasted. If So if you want something that is a little milder in sweetness, then their signature tea, the Lavender London Fog, is also one of my faves that you must try out if you like teas. Mm -mm, so, so good. <laughs> so while I'm here, let's do a quick recap of Hartwell. Here in Hart County, you can enjoy a beautiful quality of life that's connected to nature and have more relaxation while also being conveniently located to everything 
proximity to Atlanta, Greenville, and both of the Atlanta airports and the Greenville airports. Um, you also have quick access to weekend vacations to the mountains or a coastline. Lake Hartwell has more than you know, 35 waterfall tours, uh, great biking trails, and the Bass Masters host their, fav their major fishing tournament on Lake Hartwell every single year. The housing and the land are very affordable compared to metropolitan areas, making it more attainable for families to buy their first or second homes. The home ownership rate is 74% here, and the Hart County School System has a brand new college and career academy with a 98% graduation rate. Sporting and arts programs there are top notch. So let me just say that if you decide to relocate to Hartwell or Hart County, then you won't be a stranger for long because it, along with several other surrounding counties, offers that good old fashioned Southern hospitality where people greet one another with a smile. So again, if you're looking to move in nine days or 90 days, be sure to give me a call, shoot me a text, or send me an email. And better yet, be sure to comment below. Let me know where you're coming from. Or one of the biggest questions that you may have regarding Hartwell or any of the surrounding areas. And I would love to be able to help you out. So until the next time, I hope to see you around town. Bye.